In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can reset your licensing or change license type in Autodesk products from 2021 and under. Let's start off with if you can get into the software. For both the 2020 and newer and 2019 and older, it's the same. Once you're in the software, you come up to the top, you click on the little arrow, go to About, Manage License, and then you click Change License Type. Then the next time you open the software, it will let you choose what type of license you are, whether it's sign in or serial number or network license. If you cannot get into the software, there are mostly two ways to do it, depending on what version. Let's start with 2019 and under. To do this, first open File Explorer and browse to C, Program Data, Autodesk, CLM, LGS, and then there will be a folder with the product key of the software that you're wanting to change. Then you open the LGS data file in Notepad, and then you change the wording in correspondence. So here I have the path. I got the product key folders for the year. So this is Revit 2019. This is Revit 18, Revit 17. And then you have the AutoCAD ones if you were had the these here, 001. I1, J1, and L1. Uh, you have to look up basically whatever the product key of that software is you're looking for. Then you open the LGS data file in Notepad, and then you change the wording. User is the single user sign in, otherwise, you could put standalone or network. Then you save the file, and then the next time you launch, your license type will be switched. For 2020 products and newer, it's a little different. First, we open command prompt. We put in a, a string to a path. Then we put in this code, and then we can put in whatever, changing the product key here to be uh, one of these that are your software you're trying to change, and then the year here. Let's see this in action. You can open command prompt. Then we put in the path starting with CD. Hit enter. Then we put in this string. Now we need to make some edits to this. So I, I personally recommend to do this outside of Revit for, or outside of the command prompt to allow for this so I can come in here and say I want to put do Revit 2019 or 2021, so 829M1. Then I change the year to 2021. Now I'm going to grab this string and put it in here. I'm going to escape out of that and then paste here so that it gives the correct product key and code. Then if you hit enter, if it returns back to the license helper, you have successfully changed your license. If something is missing, it will let you know by either an error. So if the product key didn't match or the year didn't match, you would get an error that no such was found. Then you would need to change the product key and so on. Now, when you launch the software, you will get an option to choose what type of license you are, whether it is single user, standalone, or network licensing. And this is how you can reset licensing in the Autodesk products for changing license type. 